Welcome back to Unchained. We're here now with our youth corner portion of, of the show, and we have with us today Moss Meraki. Moss Meraki is a fashion designer, personal stylist, cosmetologist, mentor to the youth. Did I miss anything? Okay. So tell us, what is Moss Meraki? Mars Meraki is a fashion business where I offer styling services. I also design. Okay. So what, what, what are some of the things that you design under Mars Meraki? Um, I design clothing for females and plan to eventually um, create tuxedos for men. Wow. Tuxedos for men. Okay. So you are a cosmetologist as well, correct? Yes. So how does your cosmetology fit into your fashion? My cosmetology fits into my fashion because it allows me to be able to style my models if my stylists weren't be able to show up. Okay, so your business is pretty much self-contained. You can do it from the actual makeup and hair to the runway. Yes. So maybe the next time we have Mars Meraki on the show and we do a fashion show here in the studio, we can see all your talents being displayed at once. Yes. Okay, nice, nice. I like that. So. I hear you also are co-owner of a mentorship business called uh, Nerdy Enterprises, is it? Yes. Okay, so tell us a little bit about Nerdy Enterprises. Nerdy Enterprises is an organization where we educate and uplift and mentor young girls to know that it's okay to be smart and pretty and fashionable. I like that. So, <laughs> wow, so you take young ladies that may have I don't like to use the word low self-esteem, but not the confidence that they, you know, and they're smart. So and we know how, you know, other kids can be with, with, with smart kids. So you can be smart and pretty yeah. at the same time and be fashionable. Yeah. I like that. So I like that. So what have you, um, what have you done with these young ladies to date? Uh, what type of programs do you have and things like that? We have multiple STEM programs, but one that we're working on now um, is the fashion STEM, where we'll be training and educating girls. Um, they'll be able to create, design, and plan their own fashion show. Wow. Wow, that, that, that's amazing. So, how did you, what was the defining moment? What was it, because uh, you, you're still at a very young age. What was it that said fashion is going to be the career that I, that I choose? Um, the fact that I can just express myself freely. I'm not in a box. I'm not following a trend. I mix what I want. I like it. Um, I'm able to. Okay. Any formal training so far? No professional training, but I've been mm -hmm. working on stitching and sewing since I was younger. Um, I've also done research YouTube with other sites as well. I've enrolled in multiple academies um, and earned certifications. Okay. Any plans to actually go to a, a, a university on campus one day? Yes, my dream school is SCAD. Oh, that's big. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard of SCAD. So which campus? Ellen. Wow. That, that's, that's nice. So. Is it true? Because I, I think I, I heard that once you pay your tuition with SCAD, you can go to any of the campuses? Yes, they have three campuses so far. One in Atlanta, one in Savannah, Georgia, and one in Hong Kong. So, okay, wait a minute. So you pay your tuition. If you want to go to Hong Kong to campus, you just go. As long as you can pay your way there. That's, that's nice. If any, you know, aspirations of ever going to Hong Kong and, and studying in there? Maybe the visit, but Okay. <laughs> okay, nice, nice. So what is the difference between the Atlanta campus and the Savannah campus? The Atlanta campus is something that attracted me based upon me being an environmental learner. Um, I'm motivated by my environment, so the bold colors and the art that's all around um, is what really attracted me to that campus. Um, the Savannah campus has more of a historic feel and yeah. Okay. Nice, nice. So what are what are some of the, the pieces that you've already designed on, under your your label? 
I've designed a formal jumper um, that you can wear in three different ways. It has a cape that goes around the waist that you can take off. It has retractable sleeves. Um, I've also been working on a, a corset that I've designed and it's in progress right now. Okay. So you graduated from high school in what, uh, 2019? Okay, so you've been working on your brand the, the whole time since you graduated, correct? So how did you survive? You graduated, um, I think somewhere around 2019. So and if I'm correct, you started your business right away, right after graduating from high school, correct? So with 2020 coming and the pandemic, it had to be hard. So how did you survive through all of that? Um, I survived 2020 um, during the pandemic um, making masks. At first I thought that I wasn't going to be able to start my business like I planned because of the pandemic. Well, it, it helped your, 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 your business thrive, huh? Yes. So, and that's the thing about the pandemic, you know, 2020 was hard on, you know, the average person, but those visionaries and those dreamers, it, it really took their businesses to a whole nother level because they could make the adjustments to do what they needed to do. I understand you said that masks wasn't something that you wanted to do, but it became a necessity in your business that helped your business to thrive. Yes. I like that. So what what can we look for in the future from, from Kamari of Mars Rocket? In the future, I guess I plan on launching a few of my garments that I'm working on right now. So go ahead and follow me at Mars.Maraki on Instagram. Also on YouTube, you can follow me, subscribe to me at Part of My Sparkle. Like I said earlier when we were, before we started to uh, to shoot, you know, Gardner Minshew, this guy, his 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 fashion style is, 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 is crazy with it. But I love it, you know what I'm saying? So what if Gardner Minshew, Need a personal stylist right now. How can Garden Mitchell contact Kamari to be his personal stylist? Sorry. I could be contacted at the link below. I'll be more than happy to style you, so just contact me. Nice, nice. So it's been it's been great having you here today. Thank you for coming. We wish you all the success in the future. Again, we want you to come back because we want to see you here with your fashion show, doing the hair, and bring some of the young ladies that you work with with Nerdy Enterprises because that's what this is all about. This is about um, showing our youth that are doing amazing things. Thank you for being a part of our show today. It's been a, a honor, and we wish you all the success in the future. We're here for you if you need us, and again, we're at Looking forward to you coming back to do a fashion show here in the studio. And bring some of the young ladies from Nerdy Enterprises because this is what this show is all about. It's about uh, exposing and showing our youth that are doing amazing things. So congratulations and thank you once again.